mean, you signed to Rocket Records, which was Elton John's label, of course. Tell me a little bit more about that, because that was must have been so exciting at such a young age. So I remember going up in the school holidays in October 1973. They met me at the Paddington station in a, in a white Rolls Royce. You know, went to the went to the studios. There's a telegram waiting from Elton John. He could never get my name right. Well, not no, actually, he could never get my name right. Initially, he used to call me Bloodwind Pig because there was a band in the seventies called Bloodwind Pig. Uh, the telegram, actually, that's online as well. It says Madwin. Uh, eventually, he got round to calling me Maldwin. Well, my name's Maldwin, but he called me Maldwin. So uh, yeah, uh, but it, amazing times, you know, because. I was working with the very best, not just in the country, in the world. You know, it was Elton John's band. It was Gus Dudgeon who produced, you know, Space Oddity, Goodbye Yellow Brick Road. Uh, and then eventually Elton produced me himself, you know, recording at Abbey Road. I mean, it, it does seem like somebody else's life now. Thank goodness. You know, I've got, got these letters uh, to still to prove it. And the records, because we released the records uh, as well. So they're still there for posterity. Oh, and you can't beat vinyl. Do you, do you still have them at home? Do you, do you still cherish them? Are they in a, in a special cabinet, Mal? <laughs> so so what happened was, Tony, so the, la, the, the, the record I made with Elton had an A-side, obviously A-side and a B-side, and uh, I, I was on Songs of Praise of all shows uh, earlier this year, and they thought, right, we've got a new version of it, let's find the old version. So I, I dug through my old vinyl collection, couldn't find it. Somebody's thrown it out. I had to buy it off eBay. Two things I was disappointed with, Tony. One, I had to buy my own record on eBay, and two, it was only five pounds. I was hoping it would be like a... 30, maybe 50 quid a buy now. No, a fiver and I got my collection back. Before we talk more, let, let's hear the new song and then we'll chat more about it. Comes out on Friday. This is Malpug and Summer's Gone. That's terrific. My special guest, Mal Pope. Brand new single is called Summer's Gone. It's out on Friday. Uh, congratulations, Mal. That's a, a terrific song. Instant earworm as well.